Alright guys, coming to you from uh, downtown Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Uh, it's my first official day. Uh, I slept in just to kind of rest, just getting a little tired. Uh, staying in a fantastic hotel called The King Boutique, Kuala Lumpur. Highly recommend it. Fantastic. $24 a night and I get a massive room, big bed, big bathroom. Uh, so I'm just, I want to head to uh, Patronus Tower. You see it right there. But as you can see, it is a uh, bit of a rainy day. So um, I might just run across to the mall here and just hang out until the rain stops. Just, uh, just got to go with the flow when, uh, when you've got uh, this kind of weather. Yeah. All right, we're going to make it across the street here in the rain. It's pouring. Yeah, and I'm going to get so, uh, let's do this. We built this freaking camera with water. And we made it. It's all set. There's the mall. So, we're heading to the uh, Patronus Towers, which is exactly a three minute walk. From my hotel and uh, yeah the rain has stopped it's starting to clear up some blue skies <coughs> so we'll see if you guys can see this but that's the picture on this way all right we're gonna try and get up there we'll figure out how we're gonna do this I know you haven't seen it do you live in these things or are they offers? I haven't got a clue. But let's check it out. <coughs> oh, this guy's got a gun. Alright, we're at the Patronus Tower. <coughs> Suitcase unattended. So for that, <coughs> there's a whole suitcase right there. Oh, this belongs to her. Okay. All right. Let's see if we can get in here. I wonder if they're closed already. Well, it looks like uh, tickets for today are sold out, but uh, we'll see if we can get. Uh, tomorrow or the next day mm -hmm. all right guys uh, so I got my ticket so they're all sold out today and tomorrow and Monday <coughs> so, I got, so I got my ticket for Tuesday <coughs> that's the soonest um, I could get a ticket But uh, this is a Patronus. Boop. We'll be up there in a few days, so we kind of cool. Definitely uh, a thing to do when you get here. days later
All right, we're in this uh, bridge between the two towers of Patronus. We are actually in the Patronus Towers. So apparently this sky bridge is the highest sky bridge <coughs> in the world. It's a double-decker. That's my hotel right there. Oh, of course I got the snacks and the coffee shop up here. It's kind of cool. It is um, raining now. So, <coughs> what I thought. I thought was uh, smog out there. It's actually uh, ends up being rain, and a lot of it. Anyway, yeah, I was getting a little worried there because we were stuck way the fuck up there in like 83rd floor, just below the top floor of the observation deck. And uh, what was frustrating is nobody was saying anything. They just, they just weren't explaining what was going on. But anyway, managed to escape, so all good. All right, we're going to check out a few more sites here around the tower. Towers. That's a cool view right there, eh? Hey, is that a view or what? That's freaking awesome.
come here to this uh, bridge. It's uh, one of the things listed to do. I don't know anything about it other than it's colorful and uh, it looks good at night. So we'll take a gander. We'll walk through it. There's a Patronus Towers there. That looks cool with the light into the clouds. Alright guys, uh, another day here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Uh, today uh, I decided to take a little drive out to a place called uh, Batu Cave. It's about, I don't know, 20 minutes or so from downtown core, 20, 25 minutes from my hotel. So it's uh, one of these, uh, it's a Hindu temple. Quite well known. Uh, the word Batu comes from the Malay word meaning rock. Yeah. Well, lots of pigeons and surprisingly monkeys. I'm not keen about monkeys. Uh, where was I in uh, Wahin a uh, few years ago? I was nearly uh, nearly attacked by a couple of monkeys at one of the temples there. So I, uh, I give them a wide berth. I don't trust them. They're unpredictable, and you don't want to get bitten by one of them for sure. So. The question is, which set of stairs do I take? Not going to record uh, my whole ascent of the steps. We'll see you guys at the top. Let's go. Alright, halfway there, guys. Alright, guys, made it up these steps. Not too bad, not too bad. I'm going to head into the cave. You can feel the uh, cool air coming out of the cave. <laughs> you see these uh, stalactites, I think they call them. That's what I call them. Hanging from the ceiling up here. Like they're, they're massive. And, you know, eventually, through erosion and such, they're gonna fall down. That's gonna be a bad day for somebody. So, I see they've got this cage thing set up here, so maybe they've already had a few <coughs> fall down. All right, let's go check this place out. <clears throat> Alright, let's 
go further and explore. A short flight of stairs, but uh, you gotta pay attention because they uh, they're uneven. So you get used to like a certain level or certain height, and then all of a sudden there's one that's too short or too tall, and you take a little stumble. <laughs> All right, about halfway there. This poor guy behind me, eh? Alright guys, just took a grab to this uh, market called Petaling Street, uh, which is in sort of the Chinatown district of uh, Kuala Lumpur. Uh, so we just got here, uh, I'm going to check it out, uh, it looks quite crowded, so I've just been warned by uh, multiple grab uh, drivers to watch out for my rally goals. So it's just uh, very crowded, so easy to get pickpocket. So just making sure everything is uh, secure in places, keep everything out of your back pocket, that kind of thing. So, all right, we're gonna go and uh, check this place out. I'm just putting my phone away. Okay, phone's in the front pocket. Nothing in the back pockets. I have a strap on my uh, Insta360 Ace Pro. So uh, I try to grab the camera. I got a strap around my wrist, so I think I'm good. Okay, right, let's do this. Let's check out this night market. I'm 
Or if you need some cheap suitcases, there you go. I don't know how long that'll last, but... Oh, well. oh it's cool, it's got a very nice section here. Make you famous, so. Alright guys, this is the start of uh, sort of the bar, pubs, restaurants, nightclubs. This is our whole couple blocks. Uh, and so we'll take a stroll down. Um, probably a few people that won't be on the video. But uh, we'll walk down and take you along. Uh, this is the, the happening sort of part of town. A lot of tourists here. Like I said, a lot of bars, restaurants, nightclubs, pubs, you name it. YouTube. Ha, 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 ha. 
Yeah. 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 This was one of the clubs, and then the other one, VIP right there. So uh, these two nightclubs here, um, they don't get busy until the bars and restaurants close here, and then the nightclubs, everyone comes here to the nightclubs. So it was about 3 a.m. It just started rocking, you couldn't even stand, it was uh, pretty busy. Uh, decent music in both. Um, one. I think uh, VIP is more hip hop. This one's more um, dance music, but uh, still, uh, that's where people go after after hours. So. You guys could uh, sample the, the smells of the food. It's actually quite good. Gracias.
Excellent.